into your coin as much as possible. Make sure you don't arch your back here. And again, you can always bring your leg a little bit higher if you feel like your back is arching. So keep breathing. The key thing is keeping your back in neutral position. And belly button in. Very good. You're going to feel your lower abs here. And five. Hi guys, welcome to Pilates with Hena. So today we're going to do a belly fat burner Pilates workout. This workout is dedicated for myself and also for all of you who want to tone up your belly area. So let's do it together. Now I want you to inhale and come to on four position. Open your arms shoulder apart and your legs hip width apart. Now I want you to inhale and get your core as much as possible. Tuck your feet and lift your knees up. Exhale, bring it down. Make sure you lengthen your neck and look down to the mat. So inhale, lift and exhale down. And keep, breathing. keep breathing here. We're going to do it a couple more times with your own breath. And belly button in. Make sure you don't arch your back here. So 10, inhale, lift, exhale, down. And 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Engage your core as much as possible. Now try to bring your knees up and down slowly and with control here. So use your breath to control the movement. And 3, 2, and last one, slowly bring it down. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Now I want you to inhale and slowly, imagining that you have two eyes on your elbows, so rotate those eyes to face each other and put your belly button in, in your core. Now this time, inhale and tuck your feet, lift your knees up and slowly bring one arm up and down to the other side. In your core as much as possible here. Beautiful and to the other side and we try to do it 10 times each side with your own breath so keep breathing make sure you engage your core and your shoulders on top of your wrist your hips on top of the knees here and belly button in very good and five to the other side four engage your core as much as possible three two and last one, slowly bring your knees down, very good. Now put your forearms down to the mat, so shoulders on top of your elbows here. Lengthen your leg and lengthen the other leg and come to forearms planks. Engage your core here. I want you to hold it for 10. Lengthen your neck, look down to the mat. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. And make sure you engage your core, don't arch your back. And don't lift your hips too high. Just bring it down a little bit and get your core. Keep your back lengthening here. But inhale and exhale. Very good. And five. Lengthen your neck and look down towards your fingers. Three, two, and one. Slowly bend your knees down. Come to tripods. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Very good. Now come back to on four position here. Open your arms, shoulder apart. Put your shoulder far away from your ears. Now this time, slowly tuck your feet and slowly inhale, lengthen one leg. So keep breathing, lift your knee up and bring it down. Inhale, lift and exhale down. Engage your core as much as possible. Beautiful. And six, five, four, three. Make sure you keep your hips stabilized and balanced here. And last one, lift and slowly bend your knee to the other side. Inhale, lift and exhale down and keep breathing here with your own breath. Very good. Now six, five, four, three, two, and last one, lift and slowly bring it down again. You can come to try pose and rotate the wrist and come back, reverse. Inhale deeply to your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. All right. Now from here, straighten your arms again. Put your shoulder far away from your ears. Lengthen your neck. Look down to the mat. So now lengthen both legs. Come to full plank here. I want you to inhale, and you can always make a fist here if 
it's easier for you, much for you in your core. Now this time, bend one knee to your elbow, come back to the other side and bring it back 10 times there with your own breath and keep breathing, belly button in, nine, to your left, eight. You can do it slowly with your own breath. So use your breath to control the movement. Exhale when you bend your knee and inhale when you lengthen it. So, Very good. Make sure you keep your shoulders on top of your wrist here. So, inhale your core, inhale, lengthen your neck, look down to the mat, and belly button in, stabilize your hips here. And three, to the other side, two, to the other side, and last one, to the other side, beautiful. Bend your knees down, inhale deeply through your nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. Very good. Now I want you to inhale and rotate your wrist a little bit and reverse here. Keep breathing. Allow yourself to come to lie down all the way on your stomach. So bring your hands next to your chest. Put your, put your shoulders down towards your hips. Lengthen your neck. Look down to the mat. Inhale and exhale. Lift one leg up. Exhale. Bring it down and to the other side. Make sure you pull your belly button in. Engage your core as much as possible. So five to the other side, and four, to the other side, three, squeeze your thighs and press your hips down, so only your legs are moving up and down, your torso stabilized, and your shoulders far away from your ears, beautiful, and two, to the other side, now last one, to the other side, slowly bring your legs down, bring your hands over your head, so keep breathing here. I want you to inhale and lift your legs up, lift your arms up and start to pumping your opposite arm and legs like we're swimming. So keep breathing, inhale and exhale deeply. And we're going to do it 10 counts here. So with your own breath, inhale and exhale. Squeeze your thighs, belly button in. Very good. Make sure you pull your belly towards your spine to support your lower back. Keep breathing. Press your hips down to the mat and stabilize your hips here. Very good. Try to lengthen your arms and your leg. Reach your arms towards the front and reach your legs toward the back to the opposite way. So lengthen your body here and keep breathing. And five, four, three, two, and last one, bring your arms down. Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Shake your hips from left to right. Very good. Now I want you to inhale and keep your hand neck to your chest. Close your elbow to the back and put your shoulder far away from your ears. Now I want you to inhale and tap your feet here. So keep breathing, engage your core. Make sure you lengthen your neck and don't pull your chin towards the front like this because it's going to put a lot of pressure on your neck and we don't want that. So lengthen your neck and look down to the mat. I want you to inhale, engage your core. Now lift your torso up. Hold it here for five, four, three, two, and last one, slowly bring it down. And one more time here with your own breath. So inhale, lift, and exhale. And keep breathing naturally here. Don't arch your back, into your core. So three, two, and one, slowly bring it down. Very good. Allow yourself to come to tripos. Open your knees wider, lengthen your spine, and lengthen your arms here. So keep breathing, inhale, and exhale. And allow yourself to lie all the way down on your back. All right. Now from here, I want you to inhale and keep your back in neutral. Belly button in. Arms along your body and lift your legs up 90-90. So activate your feet here. Make sure your hips square. Your angle on your knees at 90 degrees. So keep breathing. Bring one leg down and come back to the other side. We do it 10 times each side with your own breath and keep breathing. We're going to totally focus on your belly right now. So keep breathing, belly button in towards your spine. Really squeeze your thighs here, into your core and keep your hips stabilized. Press your whole arms down to the mat. Inhale and exhale. Inhale through your nose and exhale through, through your mouth. Beautiful. And five to your left, to your right, 
and four. Keep breathing to the other side. Activate your feet here. Squeeze your thighs, feel your lower abs. Beautiful, and three. To the other side, two more times. To the other side. Now last one, inhale down, exhale up, inhale to the other side and come back. So bring both legs down, show your hips from left to right. Now I want you to inhale and lengthen one leg to 45 degree, activate your feet and to the other side here. So inhale and start to open your legs to the side, come back. Keep breathing into your core, open your arms a little bit wider if it help you with the, the balance and support. Keep breathing, squeeze your thighs, make sure you don't arch your back. If you feel like your back is a little bit arching here, you can always lift your legs higher and continue to open your legs and close towards each other. Beautiful. And we do it six more times with your own breath. Belly button in, really engage your core and keep your back neutral position here. Very good. So three, two, lengthen your leg. Less than one, pulling your leg away from the center. Last one. Close and then bend your knee. Shake your hips from left to right. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Very good. Now the next movement, I want you to inhale and keep your legs to 90 degree again. Arms along your body. Reach your hand towards your heels. Now this time, I want you to bring both legs down to the mat and keep breathing. Come back. Engage your core and make sure you don't arch your back here. So don't have to bring your legs all the way down to the mat just to the point that you still feel like your back is in neutral position and not arching. So keep breathing, in your core, really feel your lower abs burning here. Very good. Now inhale down and exhale up. Activate your feet, squeeze in the thighs and keep the same angles on your knees here. So every movement start from your hips. Very good. So five, inhale, exhale, come back, four, Three, good. And two more times, stay with your own breath. Now last one, inhale down, and exhale, slowly bring it back. Hug your knee to your chest, inhale deeply through your nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. All right, now from here, I want you to inhale and keep your arms along your body again. Bring all, both legs up to the ceiling. So lengthen your leg, inhale, bring one leg down, and exhale, come up to the other side. Make sure you press your whole arms down to the mat, and keep breathing, inhale down, and exhale, lift to the other side, and come back, lengthen less than one, pulling your legs away from the center, and away from your hips. So keep breathing, squeeze your thighs, and belly button in, make sure you press both hips down to the mat, so you really feel like all your legs are moving, and your core is really engaged here, with your back in neutral, beautiful, and six more times each side, with your own breath, to the other side, and five, keep breathing, inhale down, exhale up, inhale down, and exhale, bring it back. So inga your core, and activate your feet, lengthen your leg, beautiful. So three, come back to the other side, two, to the other side, and last one, inhale down, exhale, come back to the other side, and slowly bring it down, have your knee to your chest, Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. All right, now from here, I want you to inhale and hug one knee to chest and lengthen one leg to 45 degree. Activate your feet. Now keep breathing, lift your head and your shoulder off the mat. Inhale and exhale, switch to the other side and keep breathing. Make sure you press your lower back down to the mat. Lift your chest a little bit higher and one feet distant from your chin to your chest. Keep breathing into your core. Beautiful. And six, lengthen and reach. Again, less than one, pulling your leg away from your hips. And three, to the other side, exhale every time you switch. <sighs> the last one, to the other side, and slowly bring your head and your shoulders down. Shake your hips from left to right. Now the next movement, I want you to inhale and slowly lift your belly or your torso up. So press your um, belly button in and your lower back down to the mat. Use your hand to support your head here. Bring your legs down, keep your feet flat and press it down to the mat. So open your legs here with the part, open your elbows wider and press your shoulders down towards your hips. Inhale and exhale, come 
reach up and bring it down so bring your torso up and keep breathing into your core as much as possible so lift your chest and come back make sure you keep the same angle on your neck here so the distance from your chin to the chest is always a fist or like imagine that, that you put a small apple between it so keep breathing lift and down inhale and exhale bring it down into your core as much as possible here and feel your six back ups beautiful and five four exhale every time you move it up so make sure your neck is not moving you use your chest to lead the movement so you want to feel your core there not your neck and keep breathing so three two and the last one exhale and inhale slowly bring your head down inhale deeply to your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth very good now from here i wanted to inhale and allow yourself to hug your knees with your hands here so into your core inhale and exhale lift your head and your shoulder off the mat again pull your belly button in and press your lower back down inhale lengthen your arms and your legs and exhale extend your arms to hug your knees again keep breathing inhale and exhale bring it back squeeze your thighs and exhale lift lift your chest higher and chin your chest look towards the front and keep breathing so six really feel your core here your lower abs and your whole core your whole abs here so keep breathing beautiful so three two try to lengthen less than one pulling your leg away and last one slowly head down shoulders down inhale deeply through your nose hug your knee to your chest and exhale deeply through your mouth all right now the next movement i want to inhale and lift your legs up to the ceiling here so open your arms to the side and keep breathing now inhale slowly bring both legs to your left and come back to the center to your right and bring it back make sure you press your opposite shoulders down so only you feel your upper leg is twisting here and into your core lengthen your leg only your legs and your hips are moving your shoulders stabilize here beautiful and eight more times each side with your own breath and you don't have to bring your legs too far away from the center just listen to your body and feel like your shoulders all the way down to the mat and keep breathing all right so four more times stay with your own breath and lengthen your leg come back to the other side inhale and exhale bring it back and three to the other side two to the other side now last one inhale exhale come back and slowly bring it back to the center bring your knees down inhale deeply to your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth very good now i want you to inhale and bring your legs up to 19 degrees again so activate your feet here inhale and bring your arms along your body now this time dorsiflex so slowly lengthen your legs and come back so both legs at one time and bring it back squeezing the thighs lengthen your legs to 45 degree into your core as much as possible make sure you don't arch your back here and again you can always bring your leg a little bit higher if you feel like your back is arching so keep breathing the key thing is keeping your back in neutral position and belly button in very good you're gonna feel your lower abs here and five lengthen come back four if you can try to lower your legs a little bit to challenge yourself and three two now last one lengthen and hold it here engage your core feel your back is pressing down to the mat and feel your abs is burning and shaking here so keep breathing squeezing the thighs and five four three two the last one bring it down inhale deeply to your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth awesome so the next movement i want to inhale and bring your legs 90 degree again now this time slowly inhale and activate keep your feet dorsi flex now this time lengthen one leg to the front inhale and start to rotate your leg here make sure you press your whole arms down press your hips down only your leg is rotating and keep breathing into your core as much as possible 
So make sure you press your shoulders down to the mat and it should be really controlled and stabilize your body so only your leg is rotating here. Very good. So three, two, make a tiny circle to make sure your hips stabilized and balanced. Last one and reverse. So a couple more times, don't arch your back. Lift your legs a little bit higher if you feel like your back is arching. Belly button in and keep breathing. So five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it back. Inhale, deep lift your nose, hug your knees, your chest, shake your hips, and prepare yourself to come to the other side here. So dorsi flex with your feet, lift your knee 90 degree, your hips square. Keep breathing and start to rotate your lengthening leg here. Beautiful. And a couple more times, squeeze in the thighs, engage your core, feel your lower abs still. Very good. Use your breath to control the movement. And five, four, three, two, and last one, reverse. Keep breathing. And five more times, stay with your own breath. Four, three, two, and last one, slowly bring it back to the center. Bring your legs down, inhale deeply to your nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. All right, now from here, I want you to inhale and keep your legs 90 degree again. Activate your feet. Now this time, inhale and bring both legs down to the mat. Open your knees, come back and lift. 10 times, stay with your own breath and keep breathing, squeezing the thighs. Really make sure you press your hips down to the mat when you lift your legs up because I don't want you to arch your back here. So belly button in, inhale down, exhale up. Inhale, lift down and open. Exhale, squeeze in your thighs, bring your legs back and feel your abs. Very good. And three more times, stay with your own breath. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, two. Squeeze in your thighs to bring your legs back together. Now last one. And slowly bring it back. Hug your knees, your chest. Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Very good. Now I want you to inhale and allow yourself to bring your legs up to 90 degrees here. So open your arms 45 degrees, the last movement. So this time inhale and bring both legs to your left. Lengthen, come back into your core and to the other side. Lengthen, make sure you press your opposite shoulders down to the mat. Inhale and exhale, bring it back. Make sure you lengthen your neck and always look up to the ceiling. Keep breathing to the other side. Very good. And five to your left. Four. Squeeze your thighs and belly button in. Keep your hips square. Try to lengthen your leg. Let someone pulling your leg away from the center. Make a precise movement here. All right, so three more times with your own breath to your left. Two. Feel your oblique and feel your lower abs. Now last one, inhale, lengthen, exhale, bend and bring it back to the center, to the other side and slowly bring your legs down. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth and lean to one side to sit up. Now inhale, lengthen your spine here and exhale deeply through your mouth. And that's the workout for today. Thank you so much for joining me and hope to see you tomorrow. Bye.